Hello everyone welcome to my channel please subscribe and keep watching for more details 90 day. The single life star Tim Malcolm's life has been through several ups and downs since season 4 ended. Tim from Charlotte in North Carolina started his reality TV career on 90 Day Fian K. Before the 90 Day Season 3, Tim was in a relationship with model Jennifer Tarazona from Colombia. He went to meet her for the first time on the show and their lack of intimacy led Jennifer to deduce that Tim was gay. Fans started speculating that Tim was not interested in women because he was transgender. However, Tim's close friendship with his ex Veronica Rodriguez was also making Jennifer insecure. Tim and Jennifer broke up because he couldn't afford her K-1 visa expenses. Tim and Veronica have been inseparable since they met many moons ago when Veronica was going through a divorce. Veronica's ex-husband and baby daddy had cheated on her. Tim stepped in as a father figure for Veronica's child. The couple were engaged and together for close to a decade before B90. Tim briefly dated Linda Ramirez, but was single when he met Luisa Beltran in season four. Tim was announced as a cast member in 90 Day, the single life season four. So far, Tim had only been third wheeling in Veronica's relationships in the spinoff. Tim went to a singles event where he connected with Luisa. He had known Luisa from social media, but they were both dating different people at the time. Tim thought Luisa was cute, and they went on a golfing date together for the first time. Luisa wanted Tim to do some PDA, but his hesitation showed major red flags in Tim's behavior. Luisa tried to get Tim to kiss her after their double date with Veronica and Jamal. Tim accused Luisa of forcing him, but he suddenly kissed her. Tim had several excuses ready to not kiss Luisa. He claimed it was the perfect moment for a kiss, except for the fact that I just ate. Tim apparently wanted to go home and brush his teeth instead of kissing Luisa. It's probably then that Luisa came to her conclusion about Tim's sexuality. Tim and Luisa were broken up when they came to the tell-all. Luisa seemed to have become better friends with Jamal, and the two even sparked romance rumors by spending time together at the hotel. Luisa revealed that they never had any physical relationship after that. Tim was never emotionally available for Luisa. When she asked him to meet her, he made excuses about him being sick. He would complain about his back, his mouth, his jaw. Tim preferred spending time with his male friends rather than meeting Luisa even when he was in her area. Luisa's friends told her that Tim was not into her or any other women. Luisa wasn't afraid of looking Tim in the eye during the tell-all and telling him, I really think that you are gay. Tim looked at her nonchalantly letting Luisa vent it all out. She also accused Tim and Luisa of having a fake friendship. She said they were pretending to be friends as they often spoke badly about each other to her and Jamal when they were dating. Luisa even claimed Veronica had called Jamal trash during a drunken girls' night out. Tim and Luisa's relationship was over even before it started due to Tim's fear of intimacy. He said he was a Southern man and didn't want another notch in his belt when he met the perfect woman. He would sleep with her only if he felt like their relationship was meant to last. Regardless, Tim's journey on 90 Day Fan K didn't end, despite his split with Luisa. He was recently seen in an episode of Pillow Talk where Tim and Veronica went to meet Kenny Niedermeyer and Armando Rubio in Mexico. While Tim was sitting on the couch, fans noticed something unusual about Tim's feet. His follower, Nessa underscore 1310, commented, I was just watching it what was going on with Tim feet. Is he sick? If he is, I pray he gets better. Kenny replied to the fan saying that he guaranteed his hand and face were not swollen at all. Someone pointed out that Tim's belly also looked swollen and that he should get his kidneys checked. Tim didn't respond, but Veronica added that she told Tim the same although she thought it was from flying in and the elevation. 
Tim and Veronica's close friendship was scrutinized by Luisa. She wanted fans to believe that Tim and Veronica aren't real friends, but are faking it for the camera. However, Tim and Veronica keep proving that their bond is too deep for viewers to understand. From time to time, Tim has been co-parenting Veronica's daughter, Chloe, since she was a toddler. Chloe is now almost 18 and Tim still cares for her as a father. He wished Veronica Happy Mother's Day in May 2024 by sharing an unseen throwback of them as a family at Christmas 2009.